Hi, welcome to Wig with Christy. I'm Christy, and today I'm bringing you a review of Trending Tresses by Gabor. This is a new wig for 2020. I'm showing this to you in sunlit chestnut, which is GL1012. Let's go ahead and dive into this review. Down below is Link to Wig Studio One, who sent me this wig. So I just want to thank Wig Studio One for sending me this so I could review it for you. So Trending Tresses is a sleek, straight style. Has a couple layers, long layers in it. Has mainly some layers here with um, the side swept bang. This bang is a full bang. Uh, remember my forehead is short, ladies. Uh, you can cut this and trim this to what you want. Now, this is what I love about, I will say this, when you have pieces like this, it can seem like, whoa, those bangs are long. But it's actually designed for your favor, so that if you wanna customize them, everybody has different lengths of forehead. So they kinda go, I think, a little bit longer. And then if people want to trim to where their length is, they can. So for me, you know, I have a shorter forehead, so I would be doing a lot more cutting, probably. Or you could keep this style side to side swept, okay? So just keep in mind that that's why these are longer is to allow for customization for you for the length that you want for the bangs if you want a full fringe. This has a, a mono center part with a polyurethane, no lace front in the front here. And I will show that to you when we show you inside the cap. This is made with the Flex Light Fibers, which feel very natural feeling. I do love Gabor's Flex Light Fibers. They feel like a very natural, high protein of a, of a hair quality. Um, very light density, no permatease in this piece, um, but doesn't show the wefts really. C nice coverage, you know, I'm not, um, I mean, obviously if you dig, you're gonna feel it weft, but nothing like very, um, questionable on that. Um, I think if you're looking for just a real natural looking wig, this is going to get it for you uh, because you have the mono part here and so you can actually do some plucking in there, okay, and then use some concealer to get it even more natural looking. This is part of the luxury line with Gabor and you know what I think of immediately when I think of this wig is I think of Camilla by John Renault and I think of Lacey by Renee of Paris from the Orchid Collection. And I think this is higher than a lacy. Obviously it's better quality than that. Uh, it's not the hand tied cap like Camilla, but it's very, very nice. Feels very great and it's not as long as Camilla. And it has some layers in here. She's a really cute everyday style that I think you can do a lot with. Let's go ahead and go over her measurements. So the bang, like I said, is a longer bang. It's a five and a half bang. The crown is 12 and a half inches. The sides are 12 and a half inches. The back is 12 and a half inches. The nape is 12 and a half. So because it's kind of all layered is why you get the layered briefly, but, um, and that's why you kind of see all these layers in here. This does seem shorter than 12 and a half, but maybe not. This wig weighs five ounces which is actually pretty heavy considering how lightweight this is with no permatease, um, but it, it doesn't feel like that heavy. I actually was thinking it was gonna be in the fours, but it feels great. Um, ear tabs have great coverage. Let's go ahead and do a spin. Let's go ahead and take a look at her outside and then we'll take a look inside her cap and then we'll do some styling. First, let's go ahead and take a look at the color of this. 
This is the GL1012, okay? And it's called the Sunlit Chestnut, which is a rich brown with caramel highlights. But there's not that many reviews of this color. It's actually very well blended, evenly. Kind of like the highlights are just very faint, nothing super dramatic, nothing high fashion, just enough to give it like a kiss. Maybe that's why it's called sunlit. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take a look in the cap. So it has this mono part, and then it has a polyurethane, which kind of helps grip it. And then it is not a hand tied lace front. You can see there is some knotting going underneath with that poly strip. Okay. Velvet ear tabs with the wefts all the way through the ear tabs. Velvet nape, not extended, Velcro adjusters. So you can see that you can take out this wig a lot. Wefted cap, great stretch. This is an average size with the Gabor. Let's go ahead and put her back on. All right, so for some styling, immediately off the bat, I would say you could put a bang into her, up to you. Or you could keep the bangs long inside. Because it's a straight, low density wig, you could really easily put her in a ponytail and she'd look really great. You could also put her up in a claw. We well, hope you guys enjoyed this review of Trending Tresses. I think she's a great basic all around everyday look that I think a lot of ladies are going to like. Uh, you can wear it anytime. You can throw it up in a baseball cap um, or under a cap. You can wear just about anything with her. She's just really cute. Um, like I said, I think in between like a Camilla and a Lacey and uh, the fibers feel great. Um, so, it's up to you if you want to cut these. I, if I were to keep this wig, I would cut them um, because I'm not really a side swept bang sometimes. If I want side swept, I want them a little longer. So, um, but I think she's really cute and the color is uh, just a really nice um, brown, you know, like a basic, I'm kind of a more, I like the chunky look, but not everybody likes that look. And so I think this is a great, a little bit of highlights and just a real nice elegant um, brunette if you guys haven't yet subscribed to my channel click subscribe down below give me a comment or a thumbs up I guess I did the opposite uh, and I'd love to connect with you also if you're on Instagram I'm on Instagram under Wigan with Christy and I'd love to connect with you over there I'm also on Facebook underneath Christy McDaniel um, down below is links to Wig Studio One, who sent me this wig. So I just want to thank Wig Studio One for sending me this so I could review it for you. Don't forget to check them out. Also, any discount codes for this wig will be in that as well. I hope you guys have a great day. Don't forget to shine bright, love others, and be kind. See you next time. Bye.